The second piece is by a wonderful um, Spanish composer, Argentinian. Am I correct? Argentinian. Uh, Astor Piazzolla, who wrote many, many tangos, and this is Ausencias in absence. Getting my cues from my uh, group. And the third one is uh, Till There Was You, which does not need any further introduction. Okay, sit back and enjoy.
Marsha and Music Ensemble. I forgot to announce that the Creative Writing Group has a series of books that they are selling. It's their own publication, so you can take a look in the back. Um, I'd like to tell you what our menu for lunch is today. And I'm going to limit you to one sandwich because we have a lot of people. Uh, we have grilled vegetables, tuna fish salad, or chicken and mozzarella. So I'd like to thank everyone for coming. Please make sure you look for your retiree side beagle catalog. Oh wait, Jerry wants to say a few words. Our director of the Welfare Fund Retiree Program is Jerry Hershwitz. Just a few words. I don't want to go between food and use. So, um, I, I just want to reiterate what the gal said for the creative writing class. What you're seeing here is work that is really the culminating activity for years and years of practice and work. So what I'd like to encourage all of you to do is start something. Try something that you haven't done before, as the gal from creative writing said. We have so many that are beginning, intermediate, and advanced. So you could start a beginning class. If you're not going to try something new now, when will you do it? So think about it, really. Give it a try. Uh, there's so many between the crafts classes, the beating, the music, the writing. And for those of you who are interested also, because some of your recipients are in this room, we had the reflection ceremony uh, just on Friday down at the UFT office. And if you wish, you could look at the old reflections books online, and the new one will be online come this summer. And that's the culminating activity of all the people who are interested in doing writing across the country. So there are selections there. Actually, Muriel has a couple of pieces in there also, and I hope she does have a speedy recovery. So listen, have a wonderful summer. Make sure you register when the catalog comes out. Don't wait for it to be delivered to your mailbox. Remember, I can't control that. But it does go up online. You don't need to have a printer. Just make sure you copy the information. And most importantly, please remember, to make sure the course code and the name of what you want are the same. The folks in the office register by the course code. Once in a while, they kind of look across and realize that there could be a mistake. And that's the other thing. If someone from the office calls you with a question, please call them back. All right? Because they're holding on to your registration. So please be patient. Wait four to six weeks. I'm the only one that mails it back. So if I'm not in the office over the summer, it doesn't get mailed back until I come back. So be patient. If you do not get a response by the end of August, then call us. But please make sure you register and make sure to try something new next term. So have a great summer, everyone. Thank you. I'd like to thank everyone for coming. Let's eat.